This is the story of a lost man who found his way. Olimar Origins. I'm so excited. It's This is like a Pikmin 1 remake, I think. I don't have my abilities. I can't charge. I can't do anything. This is going to be quite the challenge. I'm very terrified. I have to find 30 ship parts laying around. Does this guy have one? I walked up. I tried to talk to him because I thought he could tell me where one was, but he just keeps spitting at me. What's going on over here? This is like a crime scene or something because I didn't kill this butterfly. I think the boulder bald blower did. I'm cracking up right now. I can't stop cracking up. Oh my god! A ship part! This really brings me all the way back to my Pikmin 1 days. Before people wanted to nail me to a cross because of my opinions on Pikmin 2. Do you hear it? That's music from the first game, dude. Like, Impact Sight song, dude. Oh, it's got the music here, too. I love that, okay? Because it, enough with the Pikmin 2 references, okay? Give Pikmin 1 a chance. Olimar's just cool. And he's just like some guy. I wish I could marry Olimar. It's the, uh, it's the bolt. It's the astonishing bolt. What's it called? Wahoo! Big fire bag here. <laughs> he pushes them away, even though they're fire Pikmin. <laughs> I'm almost dead already. This guy's definitely tougher than the rest of them. That's not fair, dude. I'm so angry. I'm scared. There's a gear here. Let's get the gear here, right? What's happening? What a horrible night to have a curse, Olimar. Whoa! Since when could they eat Pikmin? I don't think I'm gonna make this in. Two seconds left. I need like three more seconds. Please. Just let me have it. Please. Oh my. I'm actually like so angry right now. I'm like so mad. It's really putting the pressure on me. We're gonna jump right to level two here because I do have some awareness. And I like that music. Pikmin 1 reference. Another day, another day. And I gotta be clear here, okay? Just so the hate comments don't, you know, come down my throat. I gotta go in this level first because I already know this is where Moss is because somebody spoiled it for me. People wanna kill me. Can I just walk over here and light that up real fast? Wahoo! God damn it. Now we can say hello to our little buddy Moss. I love Moss. I like how Olimar feels bad for Moss and is like, inspecting her and trying to help her. But like any other strange alien creature, he would just... I just realized there's no caves, which I kind of like, because then you don't have to like break up the gameplay, which is what they're for, you know, for better or for worse. But uh, yeah, you can just have them do tasks the whole day. You don't have to worry about stopping. That's a big ass spider. Oh my God, my bad. I got in the way. My bad, frog. Hey, these are like this thing from Nintendo Land. Remember Pikmin Adventure? Oh my god, I just made a video about that. No, 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 don't get that. What? Oh <laughs> my he doesn't god. Even Man, this game is snaggerts, dude. Like, <laughs> oh, okay, I want to test something here. I do want to test something. It's going to attack me. According to Olimar's little Piclopedia entry, if you open up a baby snaggered egg, it's gonna imprint on whoever opens it and follow them around, but that didn't happen. Due to a common phenomenon known as imprinting, this baby will recognize anything that it sees or hears within a given length of time after it hatches as its parent and consequently follows it around. So where'd you get this information from, Olimar? I was actually looking forward to that. I thought it was actually going to follow me around, just like it said in the Piclopedia, but no! This is why you didn't make it as a biologist, buddy. This is why you're a delivery guy, alright? Olimar, you might as well be delivering me my DoorDash Arby's every day. Yeah, I eat Arby's every single day. And consequently follows it around. However, the Down East Negretta has two specific conditions for imprinting. The first is that the target must be tall and blue. And the second is related to the sound of its cry. Another gear. Just a bunch of little gears all the time. What happened at, what about, what about all the cool stuff? In the other game, like the dy dynamic fuel manoeuvre. Five? Moss can only carry five? I guess at this point in time, Moss is a little weaker, all right? She can't swallow so good yet. I'm stupid. I don't know where I'm going. What can I accomplish? It's like the end of the day already. These guys have bombs. Oh no, it's gonna blow up the Funyun. Wait, Farlick, not a Funyun. 
So I sent Moss to do all that stuff, and it's a she's actually like doing it. She's going around picking up Pikmin on her own. I think that's really cool. But there's three left somewhere, so... Where are they? They're over there. Moss, why couldn't you go do that? Why are you picking the Pikmin? They're gonna die! Rest in pieces. Today I made a new friend, Moss. <laughs> Imagine Olimar writing that in his little diary. I like this mode, it's wholesome. We should probably go back to the first level and finish that up. 13 days left and Moss is stronger, right? Awesome. Where are like the yellow Pikmin and shit? Now we can progress to a new area, I think. I, did, I skipped the fucking text. Can I just like jump up here? Yes, I can. And I can just throw red stare. Do you need yellows for anything? What if they made a Pikmin spinoff game that wasn't Hey Pikmin? All right, that game was so bad it put me in the hospital. What if they made a Louie game where you have to raise this like farm of these weird monster creatures, you know, just like you raise these like procedurally evolved beasts through natural selection. You know what I'm saying? It's kind of like Spore, right? And the main goal is to like collect food and kill Pikmin. Hey, what do you think? Moss, why are you dancing? What's going on? Oh, it's because I'm holding A. It's the, uh, the, um, the Socrates. What's it called? Watch this. <laughs> it actually worked. Uh, hold on, he's got to take a nap. It's the thing. It's the little thing. It could go right into an electrical socket or microwave. I think I do need yellows here. And this little man is, he's truly harmless. This guy really, he's just minding his business. How come Olimar doesn't feed this guy a bone? Huh? And then we could have three little captains? And one is this little man? Oh, it was over here the entire time. All right, we finally got the yellow onion. I think I'm stupid. I wonder what's different about them as in the yellow Pikmin. So has Pikmin one retconned then? I did see some people getting mad about that, how Pikmin 4 messes up the timeline. But does that really matter? Like, oh no, my GameCube copy's disintegrating. I have a plan. I have a plan, a Don Dory plan. It wants me to build that bridge. But I'm just gonna walk around and set up my base over there. Cause we're not gonna be able to do anything for the rest of the day. We're gonna leave that there. We're just gonna walk around. And we can get through here real quick. And then make that our base for tomorrow. See, it's not that stupid. You can easily make that, Moss. Come on, please. Oh, shit. Please, I really need this. I need this like I need the rush boots, but... Oh. 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 Yeah. And now we have a bunch of new upgrades. I love the rush boots. Look how fast we are. I also got something else. That's awesome. Let's test it out on this innocent creature. Did you know that the markings on the wristbands of this creature, it's the same symbols as the onions. Could the Pikmin and the Mamuta be connected in some way? The Nova Blaster. Wahoo! What? Oh, that's it. That's everything. That's, that's, we're complete. We're done. Oh no, we need blue Pikmin because the sprinkles. No, we don't need blues because we have moss. Actually, we don't need any Pikmin, which is funny. Let's go fight this daddy long leg son of a bitch. Always nice hearing this Pikmin 2 boss music. People think I don't like Pikmin 2, by the way. I do like that game. I like it so much, I 3D printed the ship from it, even though I hate the ship, but look. This is actually really easy if you can just stand on moss and throw the little Pikmin on there like that. That's easy. What do we get? Bugs! Fuck! Yippee! We got everything. All right, so we're not done yet because we got the blue onion to get, but we're a little low on time, but that's okay. Could it be, dot, 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 a blue onion? No, that's a orange pumpkin. I seem to have stumbled across this planet C or one of them, but where are the waves? It's so peaceful. I'll call this place Serene Shores. He kind of had a similar idea as me, I feel like. This is my favorite area so far. 
It's so, what's the word? It's, it's so serene. Oh, that's so perfect. That's so good. Oh, I love that. All right, so a lot of this day, I think is just gonna be building up my uh, blue pigment army. This guy really thinks he can trick me, but I'm too smart for him. We can just charge him, right? You're supposed to attack him from the back, but that, there you go. He wants me to take him from the back, but you can just do whatever you want. Whoa, what is this creature? That's scary. I don't like that guy. He's scary to me. We have a responsibility to be Dondori kings, okay? How many do we have now? 41. <laughs> That's not good enough, guys. I like when enemies are far away, they don't move. And you get closer, and then they start moving. That's just, you know, it's just like, how else are the graphics gonna be good, I guess, you know what I mean? This guy fucking sucks, dude. This is a pathetic little fight here. He's about to die, and he's dead. Killed zero. He's just zero threat. Boring! Oh no, I'm getting all antsy. You know why I'm getting antsy? Because I drank a lot of uh, anime girl thigh flavored gamer supplements. Hey all, Tev here. Pikmin 3, it's one of those games where you go after your Pikmin and uh, damn it. Okay, do I actually need to use yellow Pikmin for this? No. You can just use Moss's head. It's times like these where I feel just as useful as a yellow Pikmin. <laughs> Pikmin this, Dondori that. I need to take a nap after this, I think, because too much anime girl thigh, you know what I mean? This guy ate fucking three fucking goddamn fuck. Wow, look at that. Another time where you don't even need to use yellows, although it would recommend that you would use yellows because there's that little clipboard right here right there you have to weigh it down with yellows and yeah i just walked right up the water ramp the wake good night moss day nine i mean nine days left do i have enough blues like 156 okay you actually need yellows for this yeah i know for a fact you need yellows for this mama mia if i'm gonna yahoo i'm gonna mama mia what's the point of this little fence you can walk around it it's not like it'll block anything you carry back. You just get a bomb. Bullblord to the king. Bullblord. He comes out of the sand and he's like, I'm I'm King Bullblord. If he doesn't roar, as long as he doesn't roar, we will throw a bomb into his mouth. He will get blown up and we're going to throw Pikmin onto his nose. Onto his nose. Yippee, yippee, yippee. That's what the Pikmin say when you throw them. I'm live commentating this thing. Son of a fucking bitch. Where's Moss going? Honestly, we shouldn't stay on Moss anyway. Let's line up the bomb throw again. We're going to throw the bomb. They were! You know what I tried to do? I tried to command my Pikmin away. You know what I mean? Because I have that little... That little... The little trumpet. Let me show you what I tried to do. I I wanted to throw it and then line them up like that. So that it's sort of like a dodge. Okay, but instead it moved the whole goddamn fucking camera. Because this game... Did they even test a shitty game before they released it? And, and now the water's falling down. I know I'm bad. You don't have to tell. Oh, piggy bank. <laughs> a, a, a Pikmin 1 reference? Because I already get all these hate comments. Oh, you're not that good. If you had more Dondori skills, you'd be able to do better at the game. But it really hurts when they say, You know who could beat you in a Dondori battle? Jimmy's mom. Uh, this is just the tip of the dolphin. <laughs> This is this is just the tip of the dolphin. <laughs> this is just the Oh no, time's running out. Where even are they? I left them up there. Well, they can fucking die. Is the hiding mechanic like ever used? I've never needed to like hide from anything before. I'm just curious. Oh, a boss battle with a big lobs is this a God, is this a lobster or a crab or a crawdad or a crawfish? Because I'm not going to be able to fight this guy if I don't even know his anatomy. Because if I don't know what you are, then what the hell do I do with you? Where'd he go? He's over there. I'm done with this fight. Dead. He's dead. He's dead. Awesome. And we get another metal gear. I can do a really good solid snake impression. <clears throat> metal gear. Yippee, we got everything. The dolphin looks so good, right? We, all, we can all admit that. 
It's better than that little shitty guy from Pikmin 2. Yeah, this all seems familiar. Hey! Get back here! So cute. Skip. Deja vu. Is that thing eating a ship part? It doesn't look like it. Hey! Hey, I've seen this one. I've seen this one. This is a classic! Oh yeah, here's the problem. The ultimate life form is uh, disturbing my Pikmin. <laughs> What's that sound, Moss? What are you doing? Are you having fun, Moss? She sounds like a distant cousin of, like, the Mii's from Mario Kart Wii. Remember what those sound like? Yahoo! This music sounds like Banjo-Kazooie a little bit. Am I crazy? Am I hearing things? Or... Wahoo! Just all red Pikmin. Reds can swim now. Oh, it's a giant robotic fighter. Dodge it. Look, we're... we're oh, I've, I'm Neo! Look, I'm dodging everything perfectly! Pikmin can't die. They can't die. I'm too strong. All the Mars Pikmin don't go without a fight. Look, we have to split up our teams. Am I not so smart? It's the compass from the first game. We got Glumbo on his own over here who can't actually hurt this guy. But he can use lightning. Wahoo! Right, watch this. Was that not the coolest thing you've ever seen? What are you doing? I think they're just beating up that dead body for fun. That's it. That's the last part. Olimar needed his little cushion. That was the most important thing. He saved it for the last. Oh, the same cutscene too. And the music's actually in sync this time, remember? The ending of Pikmin's always so sad because it's like it's like the feeling you get when you leave a little puppy in the woods, you know? Like <laughs> I hate doing that. Remember me though I have to travel far. I'm speaking to the Pikmin. Bye, Olimar. I hope you don't crash in two seconds. He was up there for two seconds! Do you think when Olimar gets turned into a leafling? He can understand the Pikmin now. Like he wakes up, covered in leaves, red Pikmin standing over him. And the red Pikmin says, Now you're one of us. Welcome to Earth. Thank you very much for watching. I'm going to do my regular spiel here and say you don't have to like, you don't have to subscribe. No, actually this time you do need to subscribe and like and comment. You have to do all three of those things or else I'm going to get you. Yeah. Also... Discord too. I love you.